In this short video, we explain the first update we made between Toolset and Divi integration. First of all, the integration plugin is no longer needed. We are now offering a simpler solution, but the old one remains functional. Don't worry, your sites are not going to break. Ok, let's see the first change. From now on, Toolset is only being used for custom content inside the body of the page. The options you choose for your header and footer using DV Team Customizer are saved and reusable. Toolset will not interfere with your team settings anymore. Let's create a new page to see how it works. We recommend to make it full width as you can add the sidebar later on. Ok, so we publish the page. Then, let's add some advanced content with Toolset. To do so, we click on the Content Layout Editor button and are taken to Layouts. From there, whatever you add will be applied between your header and your footer previously created with Divi. In our example, we have created a layout for our custom post type called Tour. And this is how it looks like on the front end. The header and footer are coming from DV, while the body is from Toolset. Note that in this case, the DV Builder cannot be used. Finally, let's see in which case we can use the DV Builder and Toolset together. This is our page built with DV. There are few rows and elements you may be familiar with. To insert some content from Toolset, you need to go back to the backend. From there, we add a DV Text module. There are more tabs available next to the media one. Now, it's time to choose what you need to insert. A custom field, a view or even a cred form using the DV Builder. And there it is! Our view was inserted in the middle of the page built with Divi.